Okay, today's the day. It is the morning of the ACT test. It is about 7.30. I have to be there at 8, so I'm on time. I hope I did well, because like, I've never taken a, like, a test like this not during school. Like, I haven't been in school for a whole week, I, and I, I, I just hope I'm still like in the same mindset to do it. Uh, hopefully I am. I'll do well, I'll do bad. Worst comes to worst, like absolute worst comes to worst, I do bad on it, and I take it again next year. It's not the end of the world. Um, or I just use the SAT t uh, score, but part of every day next year. So yeah, not the biggest thing in the world, but obviously st still under well in it. Obviously n not taking you guys in, cause that would just be uh, bad. So yeah, heading off to the test now, and then afterwards, it's the same time as the camp open house, but it, obviously the eight. The ACT takes precedence, so if I finish early or something, or they end early, I'll go to the open house, but if not, I'll miss it. And then after that, ooh, and then tonight, uh, me, Aaron, Vincent, and Adrian are once again having a sleepover, which will also be fun, so pretty, pretty cool day. I don't know what it'll do in between the open house and the sleepover, but we'll find out. I'll see you later. Two o'clock. We just finished the open house. Yo, what's up? It was fun. Now I'm going home. Bye, guys. Like, Bye, Jake. Yeah. Uh, I haven't seen you in a while, so let me explain what's happened so far. I went to school, took the ACT, they did pretty well in it, didn't like dominate it, but uh, I'm, I'm proud of my performance. I do think I dominated the math part, I think I got maybe two questions wrong on that, so it's fantastic. Uh, so yeah, and then after that me and Cassidy went straight to the, the what was left of the camp open house. We met some of the kids, met our counselors. Uh, happily, me, Cassidy, and Kim are all in the same traveling group. So basically, when uh, the the kids go on field trips, there's two groups: the big kids, and the little kids. We are all with the big kids, so that's fantastic. So we'll be hanging out over the summer. That's what happened so far. You didn't miss much. Now let's get on with the rest of the day. In yesterday's vlog, I said that today uh, was a sleepover with me and the guys. That, is, that has been postponed to next weekend. So instead, I am seeing the sequel of Now You See Me called Now You See Me 2. I am very excited. I love the first one. I'm super excited to see the next one. This one. So, gonna go there now. See it. And then, as always, I'll give a comprehensive professional movie review from Jacob Levine. So, that should be exciting. So, I'm gonna go see it, and then I'll see you after. Bye. Just got out of the movie. I, I said I love the first one. This one was eons better than the first one. I mean, you can't even imagine. So many great things. It's like mind-blowing things that movies don't do these days. And it was just fantastic to see. The magic was mind-blowing. The plot had 
more twists than any movie I've ever seen. The entire movie was just an experience like no other, and if you have to see it to understand. So yeah, overall, happy to see, happy I saw it. Positive review, recommended. I'll see you at home. I am home uh, for the night, about to go down and edit the vlog, which I'm excited to do as always. I'm not like a, a real honest view, uh, with you guys. Sometimes, like every few days, I'm tired or, or relaxed or just don't want to do anything. And I consider for a moment to just not edit the vlog and even stop vlogging. Because like, I'm like, it's not, it's not helping me like... Uh, in life, and I just think, what's the point? But then I sit down at at my computer, I edit, and I enjoy it more than you can imagine. I love editing so much. To be able to take regular life, capture it, and shape it th through your eyes is one of the coolest things I've ever done. And not only do I love editing, I'm able to do what I love and entertain people with it. It's not like it's just for me, which would be enough. It, it goes out in the world, people see it, people watch it, they enjoy it, and that's, that's worth more than anything. So in case any of you have ever wondered, why does he vlog? That's why. I get to do what I love and make people smile while I do it. Maybe it's a, a, like 10 people, it, it's been as much as 400 people. And it doesn't matter. If I can make one person smile, one person's day better, or maybe even inspire someone to do the same, that is way more than enough reason to do this every day. So that's why I vlog. Uh, I'm gonna end it here. I hope my work has entertained your faces, and I'll see you tomorrow. Bye.